The Snow Globe Family by Jane O'Connor and S.D. Schindler. In a big house on a high hill lives a family, a mama, a papa, a boy, a girl, and baby. On the mantel in the parlor sits a snow globe. It has been there such a long time, nobody notices it anymore. Nobody except baby. Who would like more tea or crumb cake, mama asks. Inside the snow globe lives another family, a very little family, a mama, a papa, a boy, a girl, and a little baby. They are having dessert too, only their cups are so small, each one holds no more than half a drop of tea. Who would like another crumb of crumb cake, the little mama asks. In the snow globe, sparkly snow covers the ground all year. The little family doesn't mind. They love snow. They build snowmen as big as lumps of sugar. They skate on a pond as shiny as a silver coin. They throw snowballs, make snow angels, and tramp through the snow, leaving footprints smaller than the sprinkles on an ice cream cone. If only someone in the big family would shake the snow globe really hard and make a hill of snow. Then the little family could go sledding. Sometimes the little family shouts, hello out there, look at us. But the big papa is reading aloud a story. Nobody notices them, nobody except baby. The little papa is reading a story too. When he's done, the children say, tell us about the big snowstorm from long ago, please, papa. There used to be a snowstorm all the time, big ones, their papa began. The house rattled and shook. Dishes flew from the cupboards. Furniture slid across the floor. Once I got thrown out of the bathtub. Those were the days. Now there's only a gentle flurry once a week when the parlor maid dusts the mantle. Inside the snow globe, nobody except the little baby notices. A flurry? Who cares? What the family wants is a great big snowstorm, a blizzard. That's what the children in the big house are hoping for too, a blizzard. And one evening, snow starts to fall and doesn't stop. It is a perfect night for sledding. Off they go, leaving baby behind. It's your bedtime. The snow will still be here tomorrow, the mama says, and goes upstairs to run baby's bath. But baby wants snow now. Baby pushes her papa's footstool over to the mantel. She piles books and pillows on top. Then up she climbs. Who does she see inside the snow globe? She sees the little baby. What does the little baby see? Two enormous eyes. Baby grabs the snow globe, oops. The books and pillows slip from under her and she lands on the pillows and giggles. She shakes the snow globe, she shakes it some more. Inside the snow globe, the little family hangs on for dear life. Th 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 this is s some storm. Oh my, 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 my. Yahoo!
In the big house, Baby hears her mama calling. Come, Baby, we'll go sledding too. The snow is too wonderful to miss. Inside the snow globe, the little family runs outside. There is a perfect hill for sledding. It is late now. In the big house, the mama, the papa, and the children are upstairs fast asleep. The snow globe is up on the mantle again, and the little family is fast asleep too. Everyone, big and little, is dreaming about the next big snowstorm. Who knows? It might come very soon.